what you had observed now the book was moving and it got stopped but who stopped them was there anyone touching the book and stopping it no right there was some force acting on it right we have already learned to bring a body from state of motion to state of rest we have to apply some force here also the same thing had happened the force which was acting to stop them was frictional force frictional force is nothing but the force which opposes the relative motion between the surfaces in contact we have already learned force acts in a particular direction but in which direction this frictional force acts let's consider our example the book was moving in this direction on a surface but where does the frictional force acts in this book was it acting in this direction or in this direction the frictional force was acting in this direction right but if i am going to change the direction of the book that means if i am going to push the book in this direction the frictional force also will be acting in this direction or what no the frictional force will be acting in this direction because friction is nothing but the force which opposes the relative motion between the surfaces in contact in easy words we can say frictional force is a opposing force it opposes the direction of motion we have just learned friction but there are many more questions yet to be answered what causes friction what are the factors affecting friction or can we modify friction like increasing or decreasing friction for all these answers keep watching